I feel so inspired after our Dallas Core Mega event that we all attended, or not we all, because there's about 900 loan officers at Guild, and there was over 200 of us in attendance. We were the largest company in attendance at the Dallas Core Mega event, and it's always fun to be around our Guild family. But I'm inspired because I think a lot of people got the vision. They caught the clarity. They got some reassurance that what they're doing is the right thing. And I will tell you that the key to success is being consistent, doing the same things over and over and over. Um, one of my favorite lines is that the best business is a boring business. It's doing those disciplines that we know we need to do week in and week out. And it's a recommitment every single week because last week is a history. Doesn't matter if you were a 10 or if you were a four or if you were a seven, today is a new day for us to be bold and brave and courageous and pick up the phone and call people and ask to be their loan officer, to be their mortgage lender, to be their partner and to help build something together. So I hope you caught the vision and I hope you realize that the next thing to focus on is the next ladder. Whether you're doing three loans a month and you just need to focus on getting to six or you're doing 20 loans a month and you need to get to 25, or you've got a branch of 10 people and you need to get to 12, we all just need to focus on one step at a time. The last thing I'll say is throw perfection out the window. I just coached a group that works for me and I will tell you one of the gals openly shared that her biggest fear is getting too much business. She has a fear of success. She has a fear of leads coming in and not being able to service those leads. And I will tell you, I can totally relate. I was so afraid of pissing people off, of losing a realtor, of giving somebody less than exceptional customer service. And I will tell you that there's always going to be problems and nobody's expecting you to be perfect. We have the highest version of perfection in ourselves not what the realtor thinks or the client thinks. So change your expectations, realize that people know that if you're committed and you're passionate and you're gonna communicate, that that's ultimately what they want and what they expect. They don't expect every single process to be 100% perfect and on time and flow. There's gonna be problems. So work on your next step. Where do you need to go? If you're at four loans, how are you gonna to get to six? And if you're at 12, how are you gonna to get to 15? Who are you gonna surround yourself with? Uh, what systems are you gonna put in place? And how are you going to implement? Because it's all about implementation and the speed at which we implement. Hope you're having a great week so far and we'll talk to you soon.